Good evening, everyone. I'm Riley King, and welcome to my very first episode of Exploring with Riley King. Let me tell you about what Exploring with Riley King is all about. Exploring with Riley King will be a nightly program on the Riley King Network about people in places that make New Hampshire special. We will have it weeknights at 7 p.m. Let's begin with your first episode all about New Hampshire. So, let's begin. So, um, this is going to be all about New Hampshire that we will be talking about. I chose things that I thought all of you viewers out there should know about New Hampshire. Take a look at this slideshow we made. About New Hampshire, exploring with Riley King on the Riley King Network. About New Hampshire. When was New Hampshire founded? New Hampshire was founded in 1622. The colonial that became the state of New Hampshire was founded on the division in 1629 of a land grant given in 1622 by the colonial for New England to Captain John Mason, former governor of Newfoundland, and Sir Ferrando George, who founded Maine. New Hampshire was founded in 1622 when John Mason and Ferrando George were given a land grant by the Council for New England. Only three years after the pilgrims landed at Plymouth. The first settlers arrived near present-day Portsmouth, New Hampshire, 1623. They were fishermen. Statehood granted January 1776. Facts about New Hampshire. The state flag is right here and the seal is this and then state emblem is right here. Nicknames are the Granite State and the White Mountain State. The state flower is the purple lilac. Syringe verse is the state flowers of New Hampshire. State wildflower flower is the pink lady slipper and Cy Deerium Acolor is hereby designed as the official state wildflower of New Hampshire. The state tree, the white birch, Bootlum Pear Fry, is the state tree of New Hampshire. More facts about New Hampshire. The state bird is the purple finch, is hereby designed as the official state bird of New Hampshire. The state dog, the Chinook, is hereby designed as the official state dog of New Hampshire. The state animal, the white-tailed deer. The state insect, the ladybug, also known as Lady Bird and Lady Beetle. The state amphibian, spotted newt. State butterfly, the Kerner Blue Lindus Melissa subspecies Mellow is hereby designed as the official state butterfly of New Hampshire. The state saltwater game fish, the striped bass, and Ruckus Sastilis was designed the official state saltwater 
game fish in 1994. And some more facts about New Hampshire. The state fresh water fish, the brook trout, and Selvinus found nails is the New Hampshire's fresh water fish. State fruit in 2006, the general court adopted the pumpkin as the official state fruit. The state rock, mineral, and gem, state mineral, and state gem, and the state current in 1995, the state adopted an official state terran. State official and hormony state songs. Old New Hampshire hormony state songs are listed right here. In history of the state song, New Hampshire has the unusual dis distinction of having nine state songs, with one of them being the official, others hormony. This came about by legislative votes over a quarter of a century and was finally agreed upon in 1977. More facts about New Hampshire. State sport is skiing. State vegetable, getting the white potato named as the state vegetable, and things to do in New Hampshire. New Hampshire, a U.S. state in New England, is defined by its quantity towns and large expenses of wilderness in the northern White Mountain National Forest is known for winter sports areas and Mount Washington, the region's highest peak with the Cog Railway to its summit. Also in the White Mountains are moose, black bears, and part of the Appalachian Trail. New Hampshire's lakes region and Fasa's island filled Lake Winnipesaukee is a popular destination for canoeing, fishing, and hiking. Manchester, New Hampshire's largest city, offers the Courier Museum of Arts with works by Pescano and O'Keefe. Concord is the capital, features the McAuliffe. Shepherd Discovery Center with a planetarium and space themed exhibits. The state's small stretch of Atlantic Ocean coastline is the is the site of lively Hampton Beach in historic Portsmouth and later notable for the Strawberry Bank Museum, a complex of historic buildings duplicating local life from the late 1717s to mid 20th century. And here are a list of things to do in New Hampshire and some destinations in New Hampshire. New Hampshire political information. The governor right now is Chris Sununu. President of state is Donna Saucy. Legislation, general court, upper house, Senate, Lower House, and House of Representatives. Your U.S. Senators right now in office and your U.S. House delegation in office right now. Important places to know about in New Hampshire. Capital is Concord, largest city Manchester, and largest metro Manchester, Nashua. And Recently on the Riley King Network, we had question of the day, and the questions were, number one, do you like New Hampshire? Yes or no, and why? And question two, what is your favorite thing to do in New Hampshire and why? And question three, what should people that never been to New Hampshire know about our state? 
And we had two people that commented on it. The first one from Debbie King. She said, I love New Hampshire for its beautiful beauty during the four seasons. My favorite thing to do is spend time at our lake and enjoy the water. They should know we have lakes, mountains, and beaches to enjoy. And Bob Silveri wrote, I love New Hampshire. I love hiking and fishing. Fish live in beautiful places and I enjoy the scenery. People should know how strategically located it is. In a four-hour drive from Manchester, New Hampshire, you can be in Montreal, Canada, Boston, Hartford, Providence, Burlington, Vermont, and New York City. You are also 1.5 hours from the mountains and 45 minutes to the beach. It's the smallest state with a lot to offer. And that does it for my first episode of Exploring with Riley King about New Hampshire. I hope you enjoyed this episode, this first episode of Exploring with Riley King. And we'll be back with more episodes of Exploring with Riley King. Let us know if you have an idea what we should have on for our next episode of Exploring with Riley King. Comment below and let us know. We want to hear from you. Have a wonderful day, everyone. Good night. Bye.